Good morning everyone, hope you're all okay. Right, first of all I'd like to just say a big thank you to everybody for keep coming back and watching my videos and leaving me lovely comments and thank you to the the silent watchers as well. I know they're awesome because one of you ladies contacted me a while ago so thank you ever so much and thank you and hello to all my new subscribers as well. Right, what I'm coming on to show you today is um, what I did with the knitted piece that I showed you yesterday. I turned it into a big mama of a journal. <laughs> it's kind of what I, I, well, I said yesterday. I thought I, that's what I wanted to do, um, but I didn't know whether I'd, I don't know whether you're going to be able to see or not. It's that big. It's, it measures nine inches across, nine and a half deep yeah <laughs> and for four and a half that way yeah so it, it is it is big <laughs> um so i used i've still got this bit left i don't know yet whether i'm gonna put the tassel bits on the top so i'll just use that to close it with and then i just untangled the end bits because I like untangling the thready bits as you can see on the cover instead of sewing them in or working them in I just like to leave them that's what I did on my um, that big blanket that I made a couple of years ago I just left all the ends out although I haven't untasseled them on that see going off on one again aren't I going off track already so I just got that and tied it, poked it through, tied it on and this is it. Um, because it's, I mean, it's so thick, it must be, I don't know, at least half an inch thickness, centimetre thickness. And for anybody that didn't see that video yesterday, um, I got, I used three strands of yarn oh, was it two or three no three strands of yarn and i just crocheted chain stitch load till it was a great big ball of chain stitch to make a big piece i saw a lady on instagram do this um so that's what i did to make a thicker yarn and then i knitted it in case you didn't see yesterday again with these great big 20 millimeter knitting needles i'm i'm not a knitter <laughs> but i had a go <clears throat> and it, it's, it's just knit stitch no knit one pearl one just knit 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 <laughs> so that's what i've done um i've done, done nothing fancy in it i've just made uh because originally i thought well i'm not just going to be able to have paper because it's all bobbly and it, it i don't know it won't I won't be able to write and so then I thought well should I put some sort of cover on there but that's taking the prettiness away then so I didn't want to do that so then I remembered that I got some of this nice quite it's quite a thick card that I bought ages ago in a big box of card that was dirt cheap so I thought well I'll do that for the the front page so I've done three signatures and then I just scrunched all the paper up like we was all doing a while ago to make these fat books were they called the p-h-a-t fat books so i thought i'd do that because this paper is ever so thin i think it's um oh god you call it not copy paper oh, i can't remember what it's called but it's really super thin and it's just I don't know, it's just not nice if you just use it as, as is. So I thought I would scrunch all the papers up. So I did three signatures. I sewed the signature. Let me take it out. I sewed the signatures into the card just with the three three hole pamphlet stitch. And then I've used, I don't know whether you can see properly, but I've just used elastic. 
so and I, I, my intentions are to use it for just writing down all my crocheting and that and knitting if I do any more knitting projects that sort of thing uh, but because there's gonna be a lot <laughs> I thought what I might do is have one for my yarn projects one for my exercise yes that e word <laughs> and one for my like a food diary I'll probably just sit in my bedroom doing nothing <laughs> no I will I will use it I am going to use it so that is that I, I, I've really enjoyed doing this I just love it. I love it. Oh, it's so. I wish you could feel it. It's so lovely. <laughs> wild. It's wild. Yes. So that that is it. And it, it it even stands up. I'll show you in a minute. It stands up. Um. These. This was all just the normal A4. What is it? Eight and a quarter by eleven. Normal paper. Uh probably could have done with just a smidgen cutting off and I thought you know what I really can't be bothered the same as this when you put several pages in it they end up sticking out a bit and I thought no I'm not cutting it off I'm not faffing about doing that it's fine it's cool we don't do perfection here <laughs> so yeah it's lovely <laughs> I think it's probably um, for the watchers will probably be a, a love or a hate thing. I don't know. I don't know and I don't care because I just love it. And it stands up, look, beautiful. I suppose it doesn't didn't need any cutting off the top, really. It's all right. So that is all I've got to show you today. I'm late up this morning. Oh, well, I've been late up most days for a few weeks. I just can't seem to... I like to get up when Mr Doodle goes at five, half past five. And I, I have spells of doing that, but I can't seem to manage it at the moment. Don't know why. I suppose... I don't know how he does it. I really don't. So I am late up and it's a rainy, horrible day and I'm just thinking, ooh, I might just have a onesie day today. Just slob about. I probably won't. And I'm talking twaddle, so I shall love you and leave you. Uh, I don't think there's anything else I need to say about this. Oh, that was the other thing. I said yesterday that I was <laughs> doing it again, on to going off. Um, I was going to probably tie some bits all around the top of there just for a bit of extra wackiness but I don't know whether I'm going to do that yet probably won't I'll probably just keep this and that can go on some other journals or something but yeah I've really got my my yarn head on at the moment Right, I'm going now, definitely. Take care, thanks for watching everyone and thanks again everybody for all your continued support and your love and I love you all loads. Take care, bye.